Hey guys, today is Monday, May 10th, and today I get to start moving into my office. My landlord texted me yesterday saying that he got everything out of here that's his and that anything that's left over we can keep, sell, do whatever else we want with. So I'm going to go in there and see what he left behind. All right, so this whole back room is like pretty much cleared out. There was a lot of stuff back here. Now it's like totally empty, which is really cool. That's neat. There's a couple of downtown Cincinnati prints. I think I'm going to keep those, hang them on the wall. There's a lot of space back here. I don't think I ever made it back here to show you guys, but it's a bunch of extra storage. And then it goes all the way underneath the stairs too. This is actually a bookshelf that he gave me. That's really cool. I'll put that to use. I guess this is a keyboard, maybe? I don't know. Electric's in my name now, so I definitely want to turn this air down. Here's my office. I'm definitely keeping this desk. I think I'm gonna get rid of this filing cabinet. I really just don't have a use for it. Not in great shape either, so I'm probably just gonna list that for free. Here's Brennan's office. I know he doesn't want these big desks, so we'll have to get rid of those. Again, not in very good shape. So if I can get somebody to take them for free, that'll be great. Otherwise, I'll just have to tear them down and take them to the curb. Brennan's keeping that office chair. Here's another filing cabinet, another office chair. There's a bunch of stuff in here. These desks are in a little bit better condition, but still not great. Some more filing cabinets, a big tall filing cabinet. I'm tempted to keep this one. I like how tall it is. And these cabinets are really deep. Yeah, I might have to keep this one. And in here, I thought he was taking the conference table, but I guess he doesn't want it. So we'll try to sell that. And then a bunch of office chairs, which is really nice. We'll hang on to some of those and maybe sell some others. A little bit of furniture in here. I might keep some of this just for now. I know the kids are going to be coming with me some days when I'm working, so this will be a little area for them to just kind of hang out and play. We'll check out the basement. Okay, so we've got <laughs> three sets of washers and dryers, so I think that should be a pretty easy sell on Facebook Marketplace. There's even a door right out here to get out with them. Let's run up to the second floor really quick. Here's one desk. I think Brennan wanted to keep that. A couple more desks in here. I don't know which switch controls that light. More desks. There's so many desks in this place. It's crazy. Another one. So I got a little bit of work cut out for me getting some of this stuff out of here, but I also think I can make a little bit of money selling some of it, so that's nice. I'm not going to move a lot in today and this week probably just some small stuff i still want to keep my inventory over at my current warehouse on my shipping and all that because i'm getting a u-haul next week uh, next tuesday and wednesday will be the big moving days moving my racks inventory everything so this week i'm going to focus on getting all this stuff out of here and slowly moving some of my just smaller odds and ends in here all right i've got 17 ebay orders to ship out so let's go to the old warehouse and get that done all right guys back at the old warehouse time to ship some items we've got a card here in a3 it is a mike clevenger autograph card this one right here it sold for 16.99 free shipping and it's going out to viewer named james james thanks so much for your support next thing's back here in f52 these right here it is home flex underground elbow for poly gas pipe not totally sure what the purpose is but it has some value i got this in that ebay store buyout and it sold for 49.99 plus shipping next is an a32 sold a handful of these recently matter of fact i think i might have sold two let's pull one and see if the other one sold two this is a water timer heater something i picked up a few weeks ago that sold for 27.99 plus shipping and i just checked and i sold the other one as well so let's go ahead and pull this out this one sold for the same price 27.99 plus shipping next thing is in c52 right here this is a rick and morty portal gun keyring lights i got about 10 of these from that eBay store buyout. That's all for $19.99 free shipping. Okay, next thing is an old inventory code that says F6. And it's a set of DVDs. So let's see where I might have put them. I think this is them right here. Yeah, it's a total of three Stieg Larsson 
That's the uh, girl with the dragon tattoo. Those sold for $29.99 free shipping. Next is an E42 right here. This is a Mr. Redlegs bobblehead from the 2015 All-Star Game. We actually went to that and had a great time too. That was a lot of fun. This sold for $17.99 plus shipping going out to you if you're named Randy. Randy, thank you so much. I hope you like the bobblehead. Next thing is a really cool item. Over here in A42, this is a microphone. I think mostly used for ham radios because I picked up some ham radios here recently from Danny of Pickle Resellers. And this was in that lot. It's by Ace Static. That sold for $59.99 plus shipping. Okay, next thing I sold two of. These sets of Cub Cadet lawnmower blades. New in the plastic. Also something I got from the eBay store buyout. Two different buyers bought these. Each one sold for $17.99 plus shipping. Sold some North Face boots. Let's move this cart out of the way. Let's see. I just moved them. Here they are. C41. I got these at a garage sale about six weeks ago. I only had to pay three or four dollars for them, and they sold for $29.99 plus shipping. Next thing's over in B21. It is this Captain America Cincinnati Reds bobblehead. Box has a tiny bit of damage. I think that hurt the value a little bit. That sold for $14.99 plus shipping. Next thing's in D42. This is something I've had for a very long time, a year and a half, maybe two years. Uh, it's an Air Force Falcons trucker hat. Took a best offer on that for $8 plus shipping. Next thing is this Tigger inflatable right here. I got this at a garage sale a couple weeks ago for $15 and I sent out an offer for $85 plus shipping and the watcher accepted. Sold another card. Let's see, this is a Shaq Thompson card. Should be somewhere in here. Yeah, there it is. Autograph numbered 4 to 10. This is something I sent out an offer for. It sold for $17 free shipping. Next is a pair of jeans in B51. This is also something from the eBay store buyout. A lot of that stuff seemed to sell over the weekend. Uh, these are 541 of Athletic Taper. New with the tags. Those sold for $24.99 plus shipping. And last thing we're shipping out is in D21. It is a die cast car. I do believe it is this one right here. Let's see. Yeah, Bobby Hamilton. I've had this for quite some time. I recently lowered the price. It sold for $14.99 plus shipping. Made a couple of sales outside of eBay I almost forgot about. I sold this Kermit the Frog mug to Jackie for $15 free shipping. And I sold this leather wrapped horse to Pam for $30 free shipping. Jackie and Pam, thanks so much for the business. I really appreciate it. It's Tuesday morning. I only have four eBay orders to ship out today, which is not too surprising because I didn't list anything yesterday. I was over at the new office getting a lot of stuff cleaned up, moved out, all that stuff. And I've still got a lot to do. So I'm gonna get these orders packed up and then we're gonna head over there and get some work done. First thing's in B32. It is this Omron blood pressure monitor. I think you just like put your finger right in there and it takes your blood pressure. Pretty neat. Got that um, from Danny of Pickle Resellers. That sold for $49.99 free shipping. Next thing is some of these pilot wings. I've been selling quite a few of these. When I started, I had a whole box of 100 and I think I sold at least 30 or 40 of them. I'm doing lots of four. And this lot of four sold for $11.99 free shipping going out to a beer named Craig. Craig says, long time viewer, first time buyer. May I have a sticker to add to my collection? Thanks, Craig. Craig, thank you so much for the support. I'll definitely send some stickers your way. Okay, next is in B31. This little thing right here. This is a tapeworm dewormer for a dog. Something I got from that eBay store buyout. That sold for $14.99 free shipping. And last thing we're shipping out today is in E31. It is this really cool picture. Also got this in the eBay store buyout. Just has an awesome look to it. And then on the bottom it says, Handmade in Rhodes, Greece by Icaros or Icaros Pottery. I had this listed for around 100 because it really won a lot of comps. I sent out a best offer of $45 plus shipping and a viewer named Cassie accepted. Cassie says, came across your videos through Shed Flips and have really been enjoying them. Thanks for the offer. Cassie, I'm glad you liked the videos. Thanks so much for the support. All right, guys, back at the new place. I made a little bit of progress yesterday. I'll show you guys what I did. There was a cabinet in here that somebody came and got. Another cabinet in here and one of the big desks. I've got two more people lined up today, I think, to get some desks, desks out of here and maybe a cabinet or two. And you might be wondering why the landlord didn't get all these desks out of here. I kind of worked a little deal with him. He's letting us in early or, you know, we really are supposed to be in until June 1st. 
but he's letting us in early. So I was like, we'll go ahead and just get rid of the desks and everything. He's like, that's fine with me. So kind of a trade off. I also went ahead and cleaned up this whole back area. This is the area that you come into when you come in from the back and it was just really messy. I took a shop vac, cleaned everything up. I got somebody picking this thing up today. I'm selling that, but there is a bunch of space back in there. I just got to figure out a good way to utilize it. I also put my store on vacation mode for about a week or so because I just want to get everything moved in here, get settled, and then fire eBay back up. So that is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.